Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a little haul for you guys. So I have some clothing items and then it's mostly makeup after that. So let's go ahead and get it started. So first thing I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the clothing items I got. I only got three things, but um, I went to TJ Maxx two days ago um, and I got some pants and usually I don't get pants so I'm very proud of myself. But I got these jeans um, and they're black so I like that I had the sunlight right here to help me and they have some little rips on them really small not too big and then another one on the knee on the other side but i thought it was really cool because um they have this like i don't know what this is called but this hardware detailing and then right here it cuts off so it's pretty cool i'll try them on for you guys so you can see how they look but really excited about those and they were only 16 they were on sale at tj maxx so the next item I got is this off-the-shoulder plaid top. Let's put it over here so it's not in the sun. Um, and then it has cute little bell sleeves. It's not a long sleeve shirt. It's kind of like quarter length. And then it's off-the-shoulder and it's like this really pretty forest green and navy. I thought it was so cute. I tried it on and I was literally like, this is a yes. This is a definitely yes. You can ask Michaelin, my friend, who I went with. I literally said that as I tried it on. Um, and the last clothing item I got is this tank top, and it's just striped. I love everything, black and white stripes, black and white polka dots, and then it had this really cool um, cutout neck detail, which I haven't had something like that before, so I thought it was really awesome, and I got that. I figured it'd be really nice to put um, underneath like some cardigans and stuff for fall and winter, um, and it was $9.99, and then that off-the-shoulder top was... 15. So that is all the clothing clothing items that I got. And now we're going to move on into makeup. So the first thing I got was actually at Winn-Dixie the other day. I just got this Wet n Wild contour stick and I used it today um, for my makeup. And I thought it turned out really nice. I did have a stick that I was using for contouring uh, before but it was too light for me. So I decided to pick up this. And the next few things that I got, um, I got from an Ulta haul recently because they had all NYX makeup, I think 30% off. So I just picked up a few things, not a few things actually, it's kind of a lot. But I figured it'd be cute for Halloween to have some of the stuff that I got. So the first thing I got is just these NYX Be Gone Makeup Remover Wipes. And I've been really wanting some of these because they're nice for like game days and stuff or if I'm traveling just to keep this in my bag and then I can take my makeup off and I don't have to worry about it. So I needed some makeup wipes anyways. And then I got some lashes. I got these Ardell Double Up Double Wispies. They're so pretty. I'm really excited to wear them. And then I got these three NYX Brights Liquid Eyeliners. Well, I got them all separately, but... I got the yellow, which is in the color Vivid Halo. I got the pink, which is in the color Vivid Petal. And then I got the sapphire blue, which is Vivid Sapphire. And I figured these would be nice for Instagram looks and like for Halloween to do some creative looks for that. So I've already used them before. I used the pink one. Um, I, no, I didn't use the yellow one. I used the pink one. Um, and I, I do like it. I kind of find that it's just like the white one where it does crack a little bit. Um, if you use it like a liner, it cracks, but it doesn't look bad from afar, but if you're taking like a really close up picture, it doesn't look that great. So these are fun to play around with and it's good that they were cheap. Um, but if you're a person who likes to take up close photos, then it may not be the best thing for you. The next thing I got for the eyes is this NYX Faux Blacks Burnt Sienna Eyeliner. And it's in the, what's well, in the color Burnt Sienna, duh, lol. <laughs> but it's like this oxblood color. Let me swatch it for you guys. Well, it's kind of showing up brown, but it's really like this oxblood color, and I figured it'd be cool to do like a, a really cool autumn look with this in the inner corner. Not the inner corner, what's it called? The inner rim, that's what I was talking about. And then the last thing that I got for the eyes is this NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the color Milk. And I used to have this like a long time ago in like middle school or maybe high school, I don't know. But um, I used to love it, but I can't seem to find it anywhere. <clears throat> and this seems a lot like thinner than the one that I used to have. 
but um, this works so amazing if you're trying to do like very bright, vibrant looks. So I figured I'd pick up another one of these. And then the next three things that I got are all NYX Liquid Suede Lipsticks. And I got these three colors. Um, the first one is Subversive Socialite. Wow, that is a long mouthful. Um, but it's this very dark purple color, which I thought would be really fun for winter, fall, and like Halloween looks. And then I got this color Stone Fox, which is literally a gray. And I was so happy when I saw this. I've already tried this one on and I love it. And it um, it feels very nice and like creamy matte, which I mean, it's called a cream, no it's not, yeah, a cream lipstick. So I would expect it to be creamy, but it felt very nice. And then the last one I got is in the color Vintage, which is kind of just this brick red. It's showing up very dark on camera, but it's this like brick red color. And I figured this would actually be nice to like actually wear. I don't think I would wear the purple and the gray like out but they're fun to do for looks and then the last thing that I got is this NYX slip tease full color lip oil in the color fire dancer and I've never had a lip oil before so I thought this was like fun to play with and try out kind of excited about that I thought it would be nice if I didn't want to wear like a matte lip um, but I still wanted some color for fall and this would be nice so I'm excited to try that out yeah so that is it you guys, thanks for staying tuned. I know that wasn't really like a very long haul, but I just wanted to share with you guys what I got. Let me know if you like my glasses actually, because these are new. And I don't know if I like filming with them on because there's so much glare. But I do kind of like this look that I have going on with the glasses. I feel really cute. Real cute. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye!